Hey everyone, Jai Mungy here, and you might notice something's a little bit different. I have brought my lovely wife with me to do a reaction video today. Say hi to everyone. Hello. Now, my wife, I, I don't know why I haven't done this yet. I haven't shown her love bites, and I thought, you know what? The best thing to do would be to show her live on this channel and get her to react with me. Now, this is a Love Bites song I haven't heard yet, so this is going to be new for me and definitely new for my wife. So, uh, let's get to it. All right, everyone, before we get into this today, I'd love to know your opinion if you'd like to see my wife in more of these reaction videos. So tell them what to do. Have you liked? Have you subscribed? If you haven't, what are you doing with your life? Do it now. Do it now. It's right there. And also go follow me on Twitch. If you're watching this video right now in the first couple of hours of being out, I am on Twitch right now streaming. Come over. We might do another Love Bites one live on the channel. Wife will be in chat. You can say hi to her as well. I but also bully him a lot. She does. She bullies me way too much. But uh, <laughs> let's get into the video. I think you're going to enjoy this. It's not going to be what you're expecting. I love seeing the band sing the love questions. Yeah. Okay, I know we're only just getting into the song, but I thought I'd pause it. What's the first impression? Fun, power metal, awesome. They're all tiny. Yes. Tiny, tiny humans. Especially the drummer. I want you to pay yeah. attention to when you see the drummer. She is just like... You've paused on the spot. Does she have a star symbol? She does, yeah. Mad. Yeah, yeah. No, it's awesome. And she... I don't know how tall she is. She has to be under five <laughs> foot, but it's just like... She's just this little thing of energy and power. But we'll keep going through and we'll pause it after the chorus. <laughs> Big note on that last one. Now, Ow. you might not have noticed too much, but it, the lyrics are definitely all in English, which is interesting because mm. not all the Japanese bands tend to do that. No. One thing, and you're going to be very impressed, I don't know about this song and I haven't heard it yet, the girls, the two girls playing guitar, mm. fantastic guitar players. Uh, but let's keep going. <laughs> probably noticed something here and I thought I'd pause it. The bass player definitely looks the most happy and excited to be playing. She's actually brand new. Ah. The original bass player, who was almost like the team captain, mm. left. I'm not sure what she's doing now. Uh, but yeah, she's filled in. She's amazing as well. It's a shame it's not so much in this song, but she's got bass solos and some of the other stuff. But yeah, if you're wondering why she's a bit more like <laughs> happy to be here, she's the new girl. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. But it also seems to be a trend at the moment, given that, you know, we went and saw Avatar and their best player was just incredibly happy to be there. Yeah, and even Gojira. When we saw Gojira live, mm. he was like the happiest guy in the world with the meanest looking singer in the <laughs> world. So I think bass players are just having a better time overall.
feel like I'm on an epic fantasy quest. <laughs> it does feel like that. When they get locked in on the guitar sounds, especially the double harmonization, there's mm. not one missed note, no. which is very easy to do on a guitar. There's, there's six strings there, the pick, everything. It's just precise precision when they play it. And it, it is. It just feels like mm. you're going on a magical quest flying through the lands on a dragon. <laughs> it's, it's just... Uh, cool. Falco, exactly, exactly. It's just, it's something special. When everything, I, I look forward to every song when the guitar solo has come up. But let's go back to the drummer. She has not stopped. The... No, the, she is perpetual motion. Yes. That is... Which is insane to see. I'm sweaty thinking about it. <laughs> it, it it's unreal. Sorry to pause it again. I just wanted to point something out as well. <laughs> you've got to be a good bass player when you've got two guitarists always doing the solos. If you had a sloppy bass player there under it, you would lose the whole rhythm section. It'd sound like mud. Yeah. So she had big uh, shoes to fill. Uh, and the bass sounds absolutely fantastic. I was just listening to it under there, and it's just um, absolutely killing it. It's clean. It's constant. And I noticed that despite the fact that she's playing a five string and has like delicate little fingers, she doesn't use a pick. No. No, not at all. And I think that just kind of really shows the talent. I would like to join their questing party. <laughs> it's epic, isn't it? It's absolutely epic, and that's the best way to describe them. So what do you think? First time. Japan produces some incredible musicians and fantastic metal. Yeah, they really just, do. Maybe they're one that will eventually get to come down here sometime. Fingers crossed. Hanabi are coming down to Australia for the first time. There are more of these Japanese bands are starting to come down. Mm -hmm. So fingers crossed we'll get to see them live one day. Maybe we'll uh, film something with them. That would be awesome. That'd be awesome. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. If you'd like Wifey to come back, comment down below. Join the Twitch. I'm streaming live right now. And hit that subscribe button. But until then, I've been Jai Munji. Hopefully I'll see you on the stream. And you all have a good one. Say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>